guys my name is zara sheik today i'll be doing my project polio vaccine calculator so let's begin first we're going to select rows we have to put 6 row 3 row 4 row 5 and row 6 that's done oh i forgot one thing we can change the background color of what we like i'm going to take this light pink color First what you have to do you have to put label and text input inside the rows so the thing is we should not put it in row 6 because that's where we're going to keep other components instead of label and text input it's coming well together Oh no, I made a mistake. We're supposed to put label on top of text input. Did I change anything? No, I did not change anything. Um, text input. Put it in row six, uh, row five. Yeah. So this is how it's done on the top one. Top one. I'll just adjust it. There. Now it's all fine. Now we'll do the six. In row six, we should put button. and a label the button is going to be where we are going to press it and label is the one that where we are going to get the answer so we should change the name label 6 to result there let's start from the top here in label 1 we should put agan wali wadi one there since the agan wadi one is not in the correct position because the one is on the bottom of agan wadi in the width in text input we have to change it 80 to 50 now it fits fully then what we have to do is go to row 1 and go to horizontal alignment and put space around we have to do this to all five of them so let's continue Agandwadi two, and then text input two, 
with the 18 to 50 and go back to row 2 and go to width. Now you have to go to text input to, for the width. I'll read it that. Row 2 is for the horizontal alignment. This might take some time. for the horizontal alignment. Four would be level. And one Oh no. Four. There we go. Okay, something's happening to my mouse. Yeah. Now it's done. Now the extra input for the width. I'm going to worry fine, take the five, put it to fifty. Now it is all done. For the button one, we should put calculate. And we should also put the gaps between label and the button calculate. Now it's good. Now for the result means answer that we have to keep it blank but let's say look for now and keep it black little more see the argon worthy five and and the look it becomes more dark when you put the color again at the same choice now what we have to do is go to font weight and then keep 90 for the font and then we should keep it zero because that's where the answer should come see that dot that's where the label is now we should go to the coding part the funnest part of all the projects And now uh, we should get internalize app variable to total children. Two zero. The zero comes from math. And you saw where the Interlizer app comes from. It's a variable. Now, we should get button one click. Because that's going to be the code when the button one is clicked, the answer will come. Now, okay. now what we should get is the variable set app total children to and next we have to add 
the adding symbol from the math and then keep up total children and text input one we have to get text input one to get text not get hint now what you should do is a right click and then a duplicate uh, no, uh, what do you call button will come you have to click it and we should do this four times there all we have to change is the set uh, for the text input one we like text input two and then text input three text input four text input five that's it next what we have to do is go to result that's the answer what you have to do, do is from result set text to the join yeah we are putting the join here and the text that's where we're going to get it and in the hello we should type reals required there we're putting the two dots because for the answer that will come and the wheels required that is going to be for the result as i told that's where we're going to get the answer add that red dot when we do it and take the world block delete it and then what we should do Go to mat and take the round. And then go to mat again and take the, the division symbol. And then what we have to do is oh, go to variables and then app total children. Put out the first one. And at the second one, we should do 20. So this is the full code. So let's try it out. Life test. Let's say 12. 45. Then 5 here. Then 85. And then 2. We also require 7. So this is how the app works.